YouTube, what's going on? This preacher. I'm out here outside my housing subdivision. Come on. Walking my dog Luna. She ain't seen me for a while. So it's my Australian shepherd, my little Aussie. Say hey Luna. Say hey. Say hey. Say hey. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. That's my little girl. She a little protective. She don't like people coming, especially when she got a, uh, a leash on or, or rear run and stuff. Yeah, she don't be liking that too much. She really don't. She don't like that too much. She get protective, especially when it start to get kind of like dark like this. She'll get pr protective. So people who also is walking, you know, she'll get little antsy and barking to them and stuff like that. She will, she will nibble on you. She'll take a little snip. Like she herding sheep for real. Lona, come. Lona, sit. Okay, Kara. So what I normally do is, like now, uh, we'll take a leash off. Lona, this way. Take a leash off and let her roam out here inside this empty field. See, it's an empty field where we stay at. So she can uh, run around a little bit. Come on. So she goes and she runs around in the field and stuff. This is like the utility road. Because this field is not going to be there because we have all the power lines. Now we have underground utilities where I stay at. Yeah, so we have underground utilities. But they have all the power lines here in this field. So nothing really would ever be here. It's just a good place where she can... Uh, roam around nobody is out so she can all uh, roam around and do the stuff that she do Barry took on a, a, a nice long walk so it just for her to get out and, and just roam without anybody there she see people and she gets uh, she'll get protective especially on the leash she act like she gonna eat them up when she on the leash she you, she get off the leash, she'll just bark and stuff, but not really, not really do nothing. So yeah, I just got home. I didn't want to come home, but the loads. I was in uh, Pennsylvania, and the loads from Pennsylvania was paying so much coming to Florida. I was like, well, shoot, man, I'm go. I might as well go ahead and go home because the loads from Pennsylvania. To Florida, 1,200 miles, and paying 4,200. So I'm like, man, shoot, man, well. And then I I got a load that drops 55 miles from my house. So of course I'm like, well, 55 miles from my house, 4,200, 1,200 miles. Sign me up, beam me up, Scotty. So that's what I did. I took this load for 42. Went from Montgomery, PA, to uh, West Palm Beach, Florida. So that's what I did. I decided to go ahead and uh, take take that, take that load. I'm saying, well, I I come on for the weekend. You know, today is Saturday, so I, I, I get to do my 34 hour reset, and I deliver the load. Then I picked up another load on Monday that comes out of uh, Florida. So that comes out of Florida. And it goes up to Canton, Ohio. Yeah, the loads suck coming out of Florida. But when you stay in Florida, well, I learned to deal with it. Okay, I learned to deal with it. I really did. Now, that load is 1,100 miles. And going to um, Canton from here. And like I say, it picks up 40 miles from where I'm delivering it. And... That load is paying me fifteen hundred, so it's about a dollar forty a mile, 
you know, but where I met in West Palm Beach, I didn't want to dead head from way out there up out of Florida, especially the time that I deliver. I'm not going to find another load, you know, so I would have to dead head and lose a whole day just to what? Just to get another load. So I'd rather, you, you know, take the load for a dollar forty-three that um, takes me up out of Florida. You know, make it do what it, uh, make it is what it is. I'm trying to make as much money as possible. That helped me start off my week. Now my load's coming back from uh, Canton. You know, I'm, I'm it's going to uh, Tulsa that I got with that, and that load right there is paying me very handsome. <laughs> very handsome. That load, I'm getting that load for like 280, 286 a mile, something like that. So by the time I average out the loads, you know, by the time you average out both loads, and then that load delivers on Thursday, I'm averaging over two dollars a mile, so every load ain't gonna be that home run load, okay? It's not. But what are you averaging, Luna? Come here. Sit. Sit. Sit there. Thank you. All right, I'll let y'all later.